A stunning secret was revealed just minutes ago. Celine Tam, the young singing star from America's Got Talent, says that Jay-Z and Beyonce invited her to perform at only nine years old. She amazed millions with her voice, but behind the scenes, things weren't as perfect as they seemed. People started saying her dad was using her fame to help himself, but that wasn't even the worst part. Tune in. Something even bigger is about to be exposed, and it's going to leave everyone speechless. The Dark Revelation of Celine Tam Child stars often grab attention, and this was the case for Celine Tam, a young singer who became famous after appearing on America's Got Talent. Her rise to fame didn't happen overnight. Instead, it was the result of hard work and dedication. Even before her big moment on the talent show, she had already started to make a name for herself, known as the little girl with a big voice from Hong Kong. People were often curious about what her life had been like since the show and whether she had faced any major changes. But just as the world seemed ready to embrace her with open arms, whispers of a shocking discovery began to cast a long shadow over her burgeoning career. Her journey started long before her time on America's Got Talent. She was just a young girl from Hong Kong with a dream of becoming a famous singer. From a very young age, she had a strong love for music. After recognizing her talent, her father took on the role of her teacher. With his experience in music, he taught her important singing techniques and helped her grow as a vocalist. These lessons played a huge role in shaping her voice and understanding of music. Her parents were always by her side, encouraging her to practice and perform, which gave her the confidence to improve and grow. Her hard work paid off early in her career. In 2014, at just seven years old, she entered a singing competition in China and amazed everyone with her performance of You Raise Me Up. This performance brought her a lot of attention and marked the start of her professional singing journey. Thanks to this success, she got the chance to perform with Canadian singer Jeffrey Lee. Their duet caught the attention of many, and she was soon invited to appear on Little Big Shots, a popular TV show hosted by Steve Harvey. This appearance helped solidify her growing reputation as a talented young singer. As she continued to perform in different competitions, her parents remained her strongest supporters. They made sure she had everything she needed to pursue her dream of becoming a singer. As she got older, her passion for singing only grew stronger. She spent hours practicing and improving her skills, often with the help of her father at his Sing and You Center. This school not only helped her but also created a community of singers and teachers who encouraged her along the way, helping her develop into a skilled performer. Her early years were filled with growth and opportunity. Her story shows how much can be achieved when a young talent is passionate about something and has the right support system around them. It's a reminder that with hard work and encouragement, young dreams can become reality. She was learning different ways to sing, how to carry herself on stage, and how to connect with the audience. These skills would be very helpful later when she decided to audition for America's Got Talent. Before her big moment on America's Got Talent, she had already achieved a lot. She had performed on many famous stages, gained applause for her singing, and built a group of loyal fans. When she got ready for her audition, she relied on her past experiences and everything she had learned as a child. Her early life taught her the importance of determination, hard work, and believing in herself. These were all essential as she prepared for the next big step in her singing journey. In 2017, she decided to audition for America's Got Talent, a very popular talent show in the United States that brings together performers from all over. The show is known for its tough judges and large audiences. For her, this was a chance to show her talent to a global audience. Her audition was a moment no one would forget. Even though she was only nine years old, her singing skills were already very developed. When she walked onto the stage, she was calm and confident. Her cheerful personality quickly won over the judges and the crowd. She introduced herself with a smile and mentioned that she had a younger sister named Dion, sharing that her parents were big fans of the singer Celine Dion. This made the judges smile and showed how much the artist meant to her family. The judges, including Simon Cowell, Heidi Klum, Mel B., and Howie Mandel, were eager to hear what she would sing. Simon, known for his straightforward comments, asked her which song she had chosen. With a playful smile, she replied, Obviously, a Celine Dion song. This made Simon grin and built up everyone's excitement. 
The audience and judges were silent as she started to sing My Heart Will Go On by Celine Dion from the movie Titanic. As the music played, the room became still. As soon as she began to sing, it was clear that she had an amazing talent. Her voice was powerful, and she hit every note with ease. It was hard to believe such a strong voice could come from someone so young. Her performance was filled with emotion, and the audience was completely focused on her. Many were visibly moved by her singing. As she reached the high point of the song, the audience exploded into applause. The judges were clearly impressed as well. Even Simon Cowell, who is usually tough to please, looked amazed. Heidi Klum and Melby nodded in agreement, while Howie Mandel appeared deeply touched. After she finished, the applause was loud and full of energy, showing how much the audience appreciated her performance. The judges praised her highly. Simon commented on her incredible voice for her age, Heidi admired her confidence and presence on stage, and Melby praised her technique. Howie predicted a very bright future for her. Her audition was a huge success. All of the judges gave her great feedback, and they agreed to send her to the next round of the competition. Laverne Cox, the guest judge for that episode, was so moved by her performance that she pressed the golden buzzer, which sent her straight to the live shows, skipping the next round. She became the first Chinese performer to receive the golden buzzer on America's Got Talent. Her journey on America's Got Talent was filled with shining moments, and she quickly made her way to the semifinals. For her big performance, she chose the song How Far I'll Go from the movie Moana. She sang beautifully, and her performance was loved by both the judges and the audience. Even though she didn't win the competition, her time on the show was unforgettable. But little did she know, something even more exciting was about to happen. She had always dreamed of meeting her namesake, the famous singer Celine Dion. After being eliminated from the show, she felt a deep sense of gratitude for the opportunity to perform on such a big stage. She took to Twitter to thank her fans and shared a video of herself singing My Heart Will Go On, the song she had performed during her audition. The video quickly became popular on YouTube, touching the hearts of many who watched it. Soon, a tweet would change everything. Then, just one week after leaving the show, something incredible happened. Celine Dion herself reached out to her on Twitter. She praised Celine's performances and invited her and her family to come to her concert in Las Vegas. Celine was overjoyed. Meeting her idol was beyond what she ever imagined. When they arrived in Las Vegas, she and her family were warmly welcomed by Celine Dion. The famous singer was kind and generous with her time making them feel special. Meeting her idol wasn't just a dream come true for Celine. It was a moment of pure admiration. She didn't just look up to Celine Dion for her incredible voice, but also for her kindness and humility. During their time together, Celine Dion offered some valuable advice to the young singer. She told her to keep believing in herself and to work hard because her future was bright. These words had a deep effect on Celine, who already held so much respect for the star. Inspired by this meeting, she felt more motivated than ever to chase her dream of becoming a singer. To make things even better, she and her family got to watch Celine Dion perform live that night. It was a breathtaking experience for Celine, one that filled her with gratitude for the incredible opportunity to meet and learn from her idol. This unforgettable encounter wasn't just a special moment for her. It pushed her to keep following her passion. Her story inspired many others showing them that with hard work and belief in yourself, amazing things can happen. Sometimes, one special moment can change everything. For Celine, this meeting with her idol helped shape her path in life. It gave her the push she needed to keep going, and it also brought her worldwide attention. Young singers everywhere saw her as a role model, someone who proved that dedication and passion could lead to success. After her time on America's Got Talent, Rumors began to circulate about her relationship with her father, hinting at the challenges fame can bring. Despite this, her parents remained strong supporters, helping her navigate the new world of fame she was entering. This phase of her life was just the start of her rise to stardom, and she showed her strength and focus by continuing her musical journey.